Texas Recreation and Park Society is a great asset to anybody that's in the parks and rec industry here in Texas. We participate as much as we can in both our central region and the statewide competitions for the maintenance rodeo or for other awards and things like that. The maintenance rodeo is always an exciting time for, for our guys. They look forward to it every year. This year at the last Central Texas event, there was 24 teams participating from 21 cities with over 300 participants. For truck and trailer, they'll essentially take a truck with a trailer uh, attached to it. They'll have to drive through an obstacle course, but there'll be cones set up that they drive through and there'll be a tennis ball on the top of each cone. If they knock over that tennis ball as they're making their turns and things, they'll have points deducted. We really preach teamwork a lot here in the Parks Department and across the city, and I think this is just a great example of, of that team building and teamwork mentality. My favorite part, I would say, is uh, the truck and trailer because it's a team event and you and your buddy go in there and you get to represent for your city. They have the skills and the knowledge to operate the equipment as um, effectively as they do it in the competition. That translates out into what they're doing out in the field in the real world. So I know our guys that are out there running that equipment, they know what they're doing, they know how to use it, and they know how to operate it safely. But we'll start working on getting ourselves ready for the uh, state competition, and I'm fully confident that these guys can go home and take, take a uh, first place trophy home for that as well.